Hello everyone, my name is Vikal Jain and today we are going to show you depreciation as per SLM and WD method in Excel. So basically I am going to use some functions over here. I am not going to do any manual calculation. So you may also do it with, with these functions. So we have two functions in this chapter. So let's begin. For that we need to calculate these five steps so first we are going to calculate year and date so my year is starting from 1st April 2018 so my year would be end on 31st March 2019 so I'm using financial year over here so let's drag and drop sorry let's drag and drop now yeah now we are going to calculate the difference between these two dates from year addition dates to year end date so the difference would be this date minus this date but don't forget to plus one because if you are going to calculate this minus this then this date would be subtracted also so we have to add one in it so calculate the proper difference so now 365 days in between these two dates now here we have 331 days here we have one days be sure your days would not be exceed than 365 days because the year is only for 365 days now we are going to calculate the proportionate year so we have one year over here so we are going to divide this by 365 okay now we have one year now we have 0 0.09068498 year now we are going to calculate our SLM depreciation it is quite easy believe me so we are going to you we are not going to use any rate let me clear you so let's begin with some functions we have first function is SLM here we have three criteria over here first is cost so cost we have here now it is asking for salvage if you have read the company in 2013 so it would say if you don't know the salvage value you may use 5% of the cost so I'm again using that this multiply by 5% now it is asking for me life so life is this now close the parentheses and enter since see I have not calculated any proportionate I have not calculated any means uh, manual salvage I have not do any complex calculation just simple function we have used now here we have depreciation but don't forget to multiply with your proportionate year because this depreciation is for one year so we are going to calculate multiply by this one so press enter now for the first year we have depreciation of this amount so let's begin with some clarification on it so we have I'm going to take our printer example we have life three years addition value 15,000 and let's calculate here so SLM method cost is 15,000 life is three so I have calculated salvage value salvage value is the cost multiply by five percent now so net value to be depreciated over here is 15,000 minus 750 so the depreciation in first year would be this divided by 3 since, since you have 3 years let's phrase it a 4 now press enter C sorry G5 let's lock it also now press drag and drop now see we have 4750 in every year so this is 4750 so you not need to calculate these kind of working so you may simply calculate your depreciation through SLM method now let's calculate the WD method it is quite easy also so now this time I'm going to use another function that is DB means declining balancing method cost cost is our addition value comma salvage again I'm going to use 5% of it multiply by 5% 
now it is asking for me live live now period so you are calculating your depreciation for the year one so I am using year one now fifth argument is month so if you are calculating depreciation for month suppose for one month so you have to use one for two month you have to use two for 12 month you have to use 12 but by default it is take it takes 12 so it is optional so I'm not using it close the parentheses enter so for the year one we have depreciation 9480 but don't forget to multiply with your proportionate since we have proportion number of days over here so multiply this and press enter so we have 9420 no, sorry 9480 amount so this is the WDB method let's justify with this so I'm going to use DB function over here again so cost is this sorry first calculate net value to be depreciated so this minus this so I'm going to depreciate this value so let's begin with DB function here DB cost is this salvage value is this life is this period I'm calculating depreciation for period one so I'm again skipping month let's lock it lock it F4 and uh, now see the total value to be depreciated over here 14,250 so here 14,250 approx and here 14,250 approx so I have used SLN or WDB method SLN or DB function so you may use these kind of function in your calculation part so keep enjoying and